hi everyone my name is sharon so god is saying that it's time to confuse your enemies don't look like what you are going through don't look like your situation confuse them let them be so confused and wonder if you are okay in life or not okay because there's nothing about you that has changed everything about you has remained the same despite what you are going through that is why when you read the book of first thessalonians chapter 5 verse 16 the bible says rejoice always pray continually give thanks in all circumstances for this is god's will for you in christ jesus so if someone is praying continually it means that you are praying in good times and bad times it means that you are rejoicing it means that you are rejoicing and giving thanks in good times and bad times and even people who are close to you they won't even be aware when something is right or wrong in your life other people you know when they are going through something challenging through a difficult time because you can hear them by the kind of prayers that they are making you can hear them now by engaging in prayer by engaging in fasting while you know that before they were not engaging in these things but god is saying that this must just become a norm whether things are going right or going wrong this must just become the norm and you are going to confuse your enemies that is why here also when you read the book of Matthew chapter 6 verse 16 the Bible says when you fast do not look so much as as hypocrites do for they disfigure their faces to show others they are fasting truly i tell you they have received their reward in full but when you fast put oil on your head and wash your face so that it will not be obvious to others that you are fasting but only to your father who is unseen and your father who sees what is done in secret will reward you so god is saying that he wants to reward you but it's important to be joyful always to be clean always to be praying always and confuse your enemies in the mighty name of jesus amen